love her socks. Her socks are the socks of my life. I'm just gonna turn him into an eco hot master. Mission failed. We'll get him next time. Hello there, honey buns, and welcome back to another tiny cast makeover video in Evergreen Harbor. Sandwiched between rolling hills of evergreen forest on one side and the waters of Willapit sound on the other, Evergreen Harbor used to be the industrial hub of the region. However, as the world changed around it, the region has struggled to keep up. A place where Sims value their community and neighborly love isn't just a pastime. Evergreen Harbor now stands on the precipitous of the what? Precipice of making its own future. The only question is, what kind of future will it be? <laughs> well, honey buns, I don't know about you, but I am amused and oh my god, this polluted air speaks enough for itself, so the future will be polluted with fireflies well that's always exciting but today we are going to be in the port promise neighborhood with the greenberg family now i do not know much about evergreen harbor because i've never played in it but i am really excited to do that after this makeover probably but we'll have to save that for a future video because today we're doing a makeover of the greenberg's family mary and blossom are a couple of old timers in this town they're trying to spice up the place with mary focused on her garden and blossom painting up unused spaces Age isn't on their side anymore. Don't speak to me like that, please. Stop it. It's a good thing their adopted son Knox is fighting for the family name to help the world a little more green. Unfortunately, sometimes he takes fighting a little too seriously. Well, Knox, that ain't the way to make people like green. But anyway, if you're excited for today's yeah, green episode, so. don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit that <laughs> notification bell like Knox hit people he also has a tough walk he's ready to beat up anybody who's not okay with the green he's ready to beat up anyone who's gonna stand in his way of this green forest and okay i'm gonna stop talking now so i like starting with the elderlies first and then go to the younglings so we're gonna be starting with mary then blossom then Knox. let's read about mary who seems like she's the cutest little farmer ever i love her socks her socks are the socks of my life. So Mary is an elder who has lived a hundred days, so she's ancient too. She is unemployed and has the freelance botanist aspiration as well as love the outdoors, family oriented and a green friend. All things green. She has three skill points in juice fizzing and four skills in po shut up and four skill points in gardening. Her family biography states that she likes to garden but she doesn't have any pre-attributed likes or dislikes since she was created before the path that added the feature. Despite the family biography's assertion that both she and Blossom adopted Knox, the family relationship lists Blossom as his mother and Mary as his stepmother. Her hair color is purple, implying that she dyes it, but when entering create a sim with her household, it changes to gray, with only her eyebrows remaining purple. I don't know why it does that, but I'm gonna purple her hair up, I'm telling you. Let's first take off your hat, you have a cute little bun and ooh, I love this hairstyle, it's so cute. Oh my god, look at that grandma, she has these, I don't know what they're called in English, but she has these earrings things, which I am gonna give to her, of course. And she already has some wrinkles on, she just has extra wrinkles on her face, and she has freckles. Oh my god, I'm gonna have fun with you. She has a nose ring and from the makeup, she only has lipstick. She seems like a very cool old lady, I'm not gonna lie. Or at least someone I would get along with. Let's start with skin details first. I think I'm gonna use the Dawn Smooth number 2 female overlay because it doesn't get rid of her wrinkles that much. I am gonna give her freckles and I think these ones will do. Her Go Pulls Me Cosmetic Contour Nose number 8. 11 and some mouth corners. Oh, she's so cute. As for your eyebrows, my love, you have thick eyebrows. I'm gonna remember that. Maybe something like this, I think, or even thicker. <laughs> I'm gonna give her V3 eyelashes because she's old and that's what I give to my old sims. She did have a nose ring, so I'm gonna give her one. I'm gonna have to give her a little more earrings that she had on before, but I don't just have the thing like only this thing for her ears so yeah or maybe i could just try to give her her original back but it's not fun this way i gave her some lipstick i know she didn't have blush on but i still gave her a little bit anyway i think i'm gonna go far with the eyeliner so i'm not gonna give it to her what i would like to find is some nice eyes and i think something like this would do she looks so good but no wait a minute 
Okay, there we go. But actually, I think I'm gonna use this eyes number 12 by 14 Siberia Wind. And now let's look for your purple beautiful hair. I may change it a little bit, just saying from now. I mean, like, look how cute would this be if it didn't clip? Oh my god, this is so adorable. Because look at that. If I put the hat on, she looks so cute. But I was maybe thinking that I could give her this hat. Because it's just so much more adorable. I mean, she just looks like the cutest little farmer there ever was. I was gonna search for a different hairstyle but the more I look at it the more I love it so I'm just not gonna do that and I don't think I'm gonna take out her bracelets and I don't have a lot of bracelets CC but I am gonna look for her top and for her bottoms I'm gonna keep the yellow socks though two seconds later as much as I wanted to I couldn't keep the socks but I think she looks really cottage for me <laughs> I think she looks really cute and I think she looks like the person that she was before you know I didn't change her personality that much just her clothes just made her look better I'm just gonna check if her shoes have purple because yes, okay. It has to match her hair. It has to match her hair because it is more fun this way. You can go on ahead and tell me what you think of Mary Greenberg in the comments down below. And let's move on to her wife, Blossom. I have a Blossom in my not so very serious right now. So it's really weird to see this lady and call her Blossom. Not that I'm good with remembering names, but you know, this is not my Blossom. Okay, so Blossom is an elder who has also lived 100 days. She's unemployed and has the master maker aspiration. She's also creative. She's a recycled disciple. Disciple? Disciple? I'm gonna have to google that later and she is also a maker she has three skill points in painting and two in fabrication her family biography states that she likes to paint but she doesn't have any pre-attributed likes or dislikes since she was created before the patch that added the feature and oh the back goes there you go it hurts me too don't worry yoga helps with the back I'm at least that's what they told me. I've been trying it for two weeks, but I'll tell you in the long run. All right, let's take everything, everything off. I see you have some really interesting earrings that you probably made yourself. So I'm kind of not sure if I want to take them off. And I don't think I will. Your hair is absolutely gorgeous. And I think I totally have something like this in my CC file. So don't you worry. And let's start with the skin details. Okay, so I also used the Dawn Smooth Skin Overlay on her. I gave her cosmetic metal contour nose i gave her gopal's me and i don't think i should be giving her much more i'm gonna replace her eyebrows with these mm sims number eight eyebrows and i think the only thing left would be her makeup okay so i added her makeup and added a little bit for me too and now i would like to search for her eyes but firstly what color are the eyes are they like i don't know what is that color oh that is hazel what's that what's hazel I don't know if this is hazel, but I'm gonna use this, even though I think it's brown, but let's just close our eyes about it. There are these Camilla eyes, and I think I'm gonna be actually using them. Just gonna tone down the opacity, and now hair, please. Oh, this hair would have been so good, and if they didn't clip, there you go, it does not clip anymore. Mm -hmm. She looks absolutely stunning with this hair. In fact, I don't think I'm gonna change it. I like this one. There's the option, of course, of this one, or maybe a Nebdu kind of thing, but she doesn't have this. Her hair is literally like this. Okay, let's move on to her clothes, which are really weird. But I have the shoes. I do have the shoes. I don't have the bracelet, so I'm not taking that off. Oh, this is a whole full body costume thing. Okay, I'm gonna be placing it separately because I don't think I have a full on outfit like that. Okay, so I changed her shirt up a little bit. It's not a button shirt and it doesn't cover her up as much but i still think she looks absolutely amazing this outfit looks really good on her not gonna lie and now let's move on to their adopted son nox so nox is a young adult who is 22 days away from becoming an adult he is also one of the new npcs the echo master who may help your sim with the neighborhood action plans he's unemployed at the start of the new game he has three skill points in gardening and five in fitness I can't tell about the fitness, but all right. He appears in the all expansion packs trailers, as well as the packs cover art. According to his family biography, he is an eco lifestyle enthusiast and encourages green endeavors around the neighborhood. That's why he dislikes the best sterlings and Jules recalled a couple of entrepreneurs living next door. Although the official gameplay trailer shows him being mean to Sims who disagree with him, and the family biography states that he sometimes takes a fighting against pollution a little too literally, he doesn't have the mean trait and has a relatively good personality. Well, that's all really cool. I'm just gonna turn him into an eco hot master. 
That's my job today here. Mission failed. We'll get him next time. And also to wanting to be an eco innovator. He loves the outdoors. He's a recycle disciple and a green friend. Recycle disciple. Disciple. I don't know. How do you pronounce that word? Disciple. But you know what I mean. He's not all that bad looking. He also has the things that his mother Mary had in her ears. And I don't think I'm going to be taking that off. I'm going to straight up search for some kind of beard that looks like his. Because I don't have a lot of beard CC. And I'm just going to use this Elijah draw preline kind of thing. This hat is really cute and I'm gonna be using it again. I think I have CC for that. He had a nose piercing and an eyebrow piercing. I'm gonna give them back to him in a bit. I'm not gonna remove these because I don't have them and okay. His ears are very big. I'm not gonna deny that. I'm gonna use the Dawn Smooth Skin Overlay. Go pose me and a cosmetic contour nose of course. His nose is his best feature and I'm also gonna give him mouth corners so he can deceive people. I don't know how. <laughs> But he will. He also has a thick eyebrows like his mother Mary. Or maybe these 9mm Sims ones. They're not as thick but they still look good. I'm giving him some lip color and now I'm gonna look for his eyes which I think are black. And I'm gonna have to tweak the eyes because they're so small. Just can they be a little bigger? There, there you go. Look how cute you look now. All you had to do was grow your eyes. I'm gonna give him V3 eyelashes because they're just fewer. We don't want him... Okay, I think that was everything that he had on his face. So now let's look for your hair and your hat. I am in love with the hat. Oh wait, piercings. Piercings first. Okay, there's just one thing. I can't give him this nose ring and also a uh, piercing on his left eye. So it's gonna be on his right eye instead. His hair was kind of something like this, I think. Like literally something like this. And yeah, I think I like that best. And now let's look for your hat. This was one of the options, but it's clipping a little bit. This one does not appear at all. There's this, which I will not even comment on. And nothing more. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to bring the original one back. If I find it. One eternity later. Oh, there it is. Okay. It kind of clips with the hair, but it does not look that bad, okay? It does... It, it's fine. Okay, moving on to his outfit, which seems... Like he's gonna go fishing, but okay. Yeah, I can see how much you train, boy. Let's try to copy this. One failed attempt later. Okay, I changed his style completely, but that's just what I do. But I still think that he looks really, really cool. He's still Nox. Just a little different Nox than the one we knew before. And that puts an end to this makeover. I hope you guys enjoyed okay. yourselves. You can go on ahead and tell me which one of them was your favorite makeover. Mine, personally, I think is Mary because she looks absolutely adorable. I just love her if she was in the garden like gardening i would go and try to help out in any way that i can she just seems like such a kind nice lady and you know another thing is the purple hair so thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to comment down below and i'll be waiting you for my next video bye